Yo, what is up everybody, it's your boy Ruben and let's go. We're about to drop some serious knowledge on you guys, Afghanistan, the heart of Asia. We're talking about a country with a history richer than a triple chocolate fudge cake, landscapes that'll make your jaw drop, and a culture so vibrant it'll feel like you've stepped into another world. So, if you're tired of the same old vacation spots, the cookie cutter tourist traps, then buckle up buttercup, we're about to take you on a wild ride through the soul of Afghanistan. Make sure you smash that like button, hit subscribe, and ring that bell so you don't miss out on any of the adventures coming your way. First up we're hitting the capital, Kabul. This city's seen it all, folks. Empires rise and fall, dynasties come and go. But through it all, Kabul stood strong, a testament to the resilience of the Afghan spirit. We're talking ancient mosques like the Abdul Rahman Mosque, a masterpiece of Islamic architecture. Then there's the Bala Hisar, a fortress that stood guard over Kabul for centuries. Its weathered walls whispering tales of battles fought and won. Hit the streets and you'll find a city buzzing with life, people going about their day, shopkeepers hawking their wares, the smell of spices filling the air. Trust me, Kabul will get under your skin and stay with you long after you've left. Next stop, we're jumping on a magic carpet ride to Herat, the cultural capital of Afghanistan. This city's been a crossroads of civilizations for centuries, a melting pot of cultures and influences. Get ready to lose yourself in the labyrinthine alleys of the old city, where you'll find artisans crafting everything from intricate carpets to gleaming copperware. And the smells, spices from the four corners of the world fill the air, creating an intoxicating aroma that'll make your head spin. The real star of the show in Herat is the Citadel of Herat, a UNESCO World Heritage Site that's as impressive as it is ancient. Hold on tight because we're about to leave the hustle and bustle of the city behind and venture into the wild heart of Afghanistan Bandi Amir National Park. Imagine this, six shimmering turquoise lakes, nestled amidst towering limestone cliffs, their waters so clear you can see straight to the bottom. Spend your days hiking through the rugged landscapes, soaking up the sun, and breathing in the fresh mountain air. And when the sun sets, get ready for a show like no other, as the sky explodes in a riot of colors, reflected in the still waters of the lakes. Alright, all this adventuring is making me hungry, so, let's talk about the good stuff. Afghan food. Forget your fancy molecular gastronomy. This is food that's made with love, using recipes that have been passed down through generations. First up, we gotta talk about Kabuli Pulau, the national dish of Afghanistan. Imagine fluffy, fragrant rice studded with juicy raisins and tender lamb, all cooked to perfection in a rich and flavorful broth. Trust me, one bite, and you'll be hooked. There's mantu, steamed dumplings filled with spiced meat and topped with a tangy yogurt sauce. And for dessert, you gotta try Fernie, a creamy rice pudding flavored with cardamom and pistachios. But listen, beyond the stunning landscapes and the delicious food, the real treasure of Afghanistan lies in its people. The Afghan people are some of the warmest, most hospitable people you'll ever meet. Despite facing countless challenges, they've maintained their incredible spirit, their unwavering generosity, and their infectious zest for life. From the moment you step foot in Afghanistan, you'll be greeted with open arms and genuine smiles. Afghanistan is a place where you can connect with a different way of life experience a culture that's both ancient and vibrant, and witness the resilience of the human spirit. So there you have it folks, a glimpse into the heart and soul of Afghanistan. We've only just scratched the surface but I hope we've inspired you to add this incredible country to your travel bucket list. Now I want to hear from you guys, have you ever been to Afghanistan? What are your favorite places to visit? Share your stories in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future adventures.